question for Jess's scene because it was based on a fairy tale design. Um, in the story, she becomes she's a beautiful woman who sells flowers. Therefore, I've added flowers into the bottom to show this, and I added sequins on the top and on the flowers for lighting. Um, further on through the play, she becomes more distressed due to some challenges set by a wizard. To add the, fa the fairy tale silhouette, the princess silhouette, I made a net underskirt. And then, as a quick change, I added press studs to it. For the other side, I decided to add an apron to show how she did the tasks. And I made the flowers less, more distressed and a brown colour. And the change is really quick because of the press studs, meaning that she can get on stage very quick after she's been changed. Once again, you're 
on the couch doing nothing. Look at the state, there's bottles everywhere. Shut up. Shut up. Back to your quarters. 
God is not happy with what has happened today. Now pray for forgiveness. No, this isn't right. Lord Gabriel just murdered that innocent woman. Surely the Lord wouldn't could go deaf. How do you know that? No, it can't be true. It cannot be accepted. Do you remember your mother and father? Of course. I love them. Do you remember the day? He snatched you away from them. Yes. He was sleeping. He killed them right in front of me. And then they took me. So would the Lord approve of that? No. No, he would not. But I cannot fight against Lord Gabriel. I, I can't! Go away! Right. I cannot let this happen any longer. I must fight back. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Once upon a time, in a faraway kingdom, there lived a girl named Flora. Although they were very beautiful on the outside, on the inside she was not so beautiful. What are you going to leave me? She lived in a cottage in the woods selling flowers with her grandmother. Get your flowers! Get your flowers! Despite her selfishness and arrogance, she did manage to attract one particular. My dearest Flora, I give you the most beautiful tiara in the entire kingdom as a token of my love for you. Flowers! Get your flowers! Flowers! So, like I said, Flora did not care much for others, but only for herself. Flora and her grandmother were walking through the woods, 
searching for new flowers to sell at the shop. You could. 
could not have completed all three tasks. I did. Look around. The weeds, they're gone. And I got a response from your friend. But look over there. A thousand loaves of bread. Now just please let me go. Flora! Well, I suppose I should have held my end of the bargain. I told you we should have done 3,000 loads! You agreed this we get done. Shut up! You did this for me? Of course, Grandmother. Grandmother, yes, dear. You do love me, don't you? Of course I do. Now of you too. Of course, darling.
It's a huge party. What's up? I wish I could tell you. Hey, come on. Not the rest of the night yet. Hey, uh, this party Lizzle is dying down a bit. Perhaps we should get the audience uh, more excited again. Speech. All right then. Get their attention for me. Everyone, everyone, let's hear it for the man of the hour. A speech. Right. Um. So, uh, John just suggested that I do a speech to you all, probably because he's too scared to do it himself. But uh, all I want to say, I just want to say, if you're here, it may, it means that you. Be a lot to one of us, but we care for you a lot, and we're going to miss you. And if the unspeakable happens, if one of us dies, assure me this, do you remember us for the good times, however few there may be. But seriously, take care of my wife, my sister. No, anyway, enough of this sadness. Look at all the booze we got left. Come on, get drinking. You ready for this? Ready as I'll ever be. If every bullet you shoot at them, Charlies, is it gonna be for your wife or your child? Love. It's cute. But I, I'm afraid I'm not going to say it again. Hey, don't talk like that. We'll get through this. Let's do what you've done the past hundred times. Shoot them down, Charlie's, and take cover whatever chance you get. Besides, I've got you back. I hope to that. Come on, Rick. 